Hey, look, Sri. It's it's like kind of like a long wavy, long waves, and then like half the head is put up into like a small ponytail, and it creates the volume on the top. Okay, so we're going to start by sectioning the hair either side, right up to the middle, so it's nice and high. And you smooth the rest of it down. And then you bring it to the middle and smooth it over. And to create the little bit of a bounce in the in the ponytail, you just bring it further forward and it creates the volume. Brush it out of the side just to smooth it down. And then you get your hairband. Pop it in, and you just bring it forward so it gives that bounce. And also to have the piece covering the hairband, just bring a section from the rest of the hair, and then just wrap it around the hairband. Just get a small crisp and pin it down. Okay, by putting the piece in, you just simply section around the head, keep the piece of hair on top, just give it a light back combing, just so it's secure. Okay, so this is the piece here. Two clips at the top, and it's nice and long, and it has that natural wave to it anyway and then you just literally clip it in. Okay, so this is the halo. It's the hair on the wire. What makes it different is because you put invisible wire and it's extra long and nice and thick as well. Okay, so the way you put it on is you take a small section on top of the head, like so, and you adjust it. Place the wire there and edge it down. The lower it goes down, the more length you create. And then you simply comb it out and bring it over. Okay, so to create the look, we're going to need a wand and you just create the nice waves, nice and tight waves. And we also swoopen it to the side because she has it coming to the side as well. So we're going to bring it all, all the hair, we're going to wave all the hair the wand and then just bring it to the side and clip. Okay, so now we have the, all the hair waved, we're going to now pull it, swoop it over to the side and clip it in.
What we're using today is the Angelina clipping. It comes straight, but I've already pre-curled it so it'll blend into the wave that we've already put into Jodie's hair. So to put in the Angelina piece today, I'm just gonna section off her hair. Okay, so I'm gonna apply it into Jodie's hair now. Just wiggling the clip on the root and pushing it against the head. Okay, so I've clipped in the piece. I'm just going to release this hair from the top. The Angelina piece is 20 inches long and it comes with six layers of hair on four clips. So it's the beauty of just having to clip in one strip and you're getting the six layers of hair, a really thick piece. Okay, now I have my piece in, so I'm just gonna give it a little wave using the hairspray wand. So we're just gonna give it some loose waves so it recreates look to I'm just going to take a brush just to brush all the curls to gather them together. Okay, we're just going to show you the celebrity ponytail today. I'm here with Sarah. Okay, so what I've done is I've pulled Sarah's hair up into a tight ponytail. I'm going to use this piece to make it even longer. This has this little clip here that just slides in underneath the bobbin and then it's Velcro. So I'm going to pull them around so they join up. This piece is synthetic hair. What I love about this piece is you can make a huge range of different looks. It's very versatile. It comes in a full range of colors, so we've something to match everybody. And simply, I've attached the Velcro in there, so I'm just pulling this around now to hide that Velcro. On Sarah today, I'm putting it up nice and high, but as I said, it's a very versatile product. It can be used much lower, it can be used higher, it can be used to the side of the head. You can also flat this all down and have a huge range of different looks. Now this ponytail is 26 inches long. So as I said, it can create a numerous different styles. It's one of my favorite pieces that we have. <laughs> 